Okay, here we are to the answer of why the electric furnace was failing. Why is discolored on the second one up? You can see it's discolored, probably even worse on that side. Okay, so why is it discolored? Okay, looking close. There's your problem. Notice this white stuff. That's this fiber stuff melting and burning up. You can see a piece of it's falling out right there. And if I can get a shot of that screw, it tells you some too. Okay, there's the bottom screw, and you can see it looks pretty good. Now look at that screw in the second one up. It's discolored. When I try to turn it, it's turning, but you can hear it crunchy crunch and stuff falling out of there. Uh, bad connection. That's all it is. These things, every year when you service an electric furnace, everything that can be tightened should be tightened. Each one of these screws should be taken down a little bit. Good idea is to use your uh, non-contact temperature probe and see if you get something warm. See, I did that in, earlier. Uh, all the rest of the wires inside this thing, same thing. Good inspection. Use your uh, temperature probe there if you can. Look for burned ends on the wires, that sort of stuff. Remember, pulling this out, which pulls the power to the furnace, does not cut the power here. So you got to go to the panel and shut it off in the panel. Anyway, tight connections, especially aluminum. Uh, aluminum was, was supposed to have the glop on it. I suppose I should do something about the glop on these days. If you use aluminum wire, there's a glop that goes on it to keep it from corroding. It tends to corrode pretty bad sometimes. Most of that is not, most of it's gone now. For a long time it was a mess. It doesn't seem to be quite so bad now. Anyway, tighten up all these things. And this thing here, remember, run that furnace for several minutes and then pull it out and take its temperature. I used to use my hand for this. I would simply kind of go like that. I burned my hand a couple of times, <laughs> and I thought, ah, I don't want to do that no more. Uh, so uh, I got a non-contact temperature probe. So that's, uh, that's what was wrong with that electric furnace.